Yeah, she hit him. He didn't hit her. He didn't take a folding chair. He's trying to gamble and mind his own business. And that happens at the casino. This couple, I guess a couple who's racist together, Mayor. Well, they enjoy this kind of thing. They've done it before. They look like they were pros at it. But let's give you some more context. Well, how about another installment? We beeped it, but you know what he said, rhymes with truth social, Donald Trumper's rigor, okay? That's what was said. Do you see how that was turned around? She's violent and out of control. She's physically assaulted a man. He's done nothing to her, but suddenly he is being attacked. Because he dare say, hey, that's not okay, you violated me. Black man who recorded and posted the video, Devon Leslie Jr. provided further context on Facebook. Here it is. Wasn't sure if I was going to post this, but now that I've had time to give it some thought, I want it known about these two people. This woman went off on me, hit me in the face, kicked me in the back because I sat too close to her and her boyfriend. So this is how I was treated. If you have any idea who these people are, I would like to know. They both were arrested Thursday night, August 3rd, 2023 for her was assault. He was intoxicated, worst feeling in the world. I did absolutely nothing wrong, nor did I defend myself against them. He knew better. That's my commentary. He knew better, or this whole thing would have been flipped upside down. I honestly feel some type of way because I didn't. Thanks to the Bossier City Police and the casino for standing up for me, because this could have gone another way. He wants them identified. Mayor, I want you to react to the footage, but I had that, remember that? And I don't remember even what it was about, but it's in my head. You about to lose your job, you about to lose your job. <laughs> remember that one? He wants them identified. Yeah, I mean, they're about to lose their job, but we see what happens in these cases, right? There'll be a GoFundMe that make them millionaires because America has enough money to fund white supremacy, especially at the expense of black suffering. What people won't tell you is patriotism is not synonymous with caring about this country or its flags or its soldiers or its veterans. He's in a picture on his Facebook, on his Facebook page in military uniform in front of a military flag, meaning the ability for her to stand and scream and kick and hit him and be that white is because of his service. And that means nothing when he's recording, simply recording her acting in his manner. The guy is like, don't record her, you whatever, right? We know it. We this is this is the unbelievable task of being black and American and and and, and interacting with whiteness. This woman, all I could hear as she spoke was the white woman that had Emmett Till kill. Yes. Oh this goodness. Sweet behavior. That's not a stretch. She thought that it was okay to act this manner because he was his blackness was too close to her. Emmett Till was 13 and supposedly or allegedly by the white woman said he whistled at her. And that was enough to get him killed in the manner that he was killed. That camera or that black man reacted in any different way is the only thing that prevented him from not being in the same position as Emmett Till. Had he reacted when she kicked him or hit him the first time, he would have been or could have been killed. And that's not a stretch, that's not hyperbole, that is America. That is America. The police could have came in there and killed that man at any moment just because that white woman was screaming and acting irate. Mayor, you're right. Because in America, the white woman is coveted and the black man is criminalized. 